and we are back it's still me on set i know i had said it's brand sakwa but nimimi ndio niko so right now we're going to have a great conversation we'll be talking about the creative industry uh on matters entrepreneurship how's the business like in this other side are you talented are you a director and you just curious to know what goes on and you know how you can even engage kids because this particular production company uh is working with high schoolers quite interesting I have been joined by uh, Jimmy Goko, who is the principal of Greenview Junior Secondary School. Uh, his kids are part of the production. And just next to him, we have Tyrus Onyango, who is the MD of Maya Production, the production company behind um, the film that we're going to see, right? Yes. Come on, Mekosea, please <laughs> correct me. <That's> right. <laughs> Say yeah. something. It's, okay. it's good. Uh -huh. yeah. A little bit about... Um, how you guys met, what the production company is all about. Let me start with you now that you're the MD of the production company. Okay. So we, we had a concept um, that we wanted to do. Mm -hmm. But uh, just having a concept is not enough. Um, and you can also have a concept that is not also complete. So we wanted to shoot a movie and we, we needed to look for, some, uh, for someone we can partner with. Um, so we looked for these guys. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> just like that <laughs> yes <laughs> so um and uh we we had a discussion about it we were able to come up uh, together this is not mm. really something that we've done by ourselves uh, because there is the entertainment aspect of it mm -hmm. but also there's the education aspect of it yeah so um it was a synergy of uh, of uh, like minds uh, people who have the same vision uh, we are all uh, interested interested in talent in a big way uh, but also, we also want to tell our own stories. Yeah. Um, one of the things that we have as a culture in this country, we have a very we do music festivals in schools. So there is a very big drama festival sort of culture behind mm. that nobody nobody ever talks about. Mm -hmm. So how do these talents get developed? Okay. Where do they start? There's always a backstory that is never told on stage. Mm -hmm. So you <laughs> so are telling <laughs> that story. Yeah, yeah. Okay. The, the people need to know that uh, Kenya has talents that can be developed to serious heights mm -hmm. yeah. amazing yeah. now to you uh jimmy they said i don't know why they decided to pick <laughs> on you <laughs> and then how wha why did you decide to now collaborate with them to accept yeah. that offer you know we, we usually like he said uh, mm -hmm. we, when you have like-minded people because i'm also an artist a mm -hmm. playwright uh, I also deal in music, but the most uh, important thing that uh, after they came, I found out that we are in tandem with them. Mm -hmm. uh, currently, the curriculum of the school has changed to CBC, mm -hmm. which we call competence-based curriculum. Mm -hmm. And uh, as we are imparting this knowledge to the young ones, we we usually talk about the competencies. Competencies, we say they are the skills mm. and the attributes that we instill to, I mean, like to our learners so that in future they can exhibit the same. Mm -hmm. And generally what has happened to, to CBC, we have like uh, seven competencies which are there that we need to instill in our learners. Mm -hmm. And by collaborating with them, these uh, competencies we have like communication. Okay. So once we do the production, we have the verbal communication because of course a film uh, has to run with a script. Mm -hmm. There is also the non-verbal part of it where we have the facial expressions and the body language. Mm. So by doing that, we are instilling that competence to, to our learners. So learn. okay. Number two, we also have collaboration. So in a movie, you know, you cannot just do it alone. Yeah. Uh, they, so we, they have to collaborate. So as we are doing the movie, we are also developing the competency of collaboration. Mm -hmm. The other one is creativity. So this is about the creative industry in film. So by doing that, exposing our learners to that, we are also developing that competence. <coughs> the other aspect is uh, self-efficacy. Self-efficacy, uh, generally, uh, if you are to look at the synonym of the same, 
we have uh, something like uh, uh, self-reliance, self-confidence. So as the learners take part in the, the acting, they develop self-confidence. Maybe somebody would like to say, talk about uh, self-esteem mm -hmm. and self-efficacy. They have a, a thin line. Okay, what's because self-efficacy, despite having the self-confidence, self-efficacy means that you also need to ha have responsibility of accomplishing something. Okay. Like when we had the learners, they are those who came for the auditions. Mm -hmm. They had the self-confidence. Uh, they took part. But now as the, I mean, the, the shoot went on. Progresses, the challenges. There are some challenges they dropped mm -hmm. along the road. <laughs> yeah. But now there are others who went on until now we have the movie. Because at times the director will come and say, uh, today we do not have a shoot, we have to redo it. Mm. And sometimes you know the director might not be very friendly. <laughs> they are never friendly, <laughs> are they? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. in that aspect, yeah. uh, of uh, having that, uh, we also develop that the self-efficacy. Okay. So among the seven compi competencies in, mm -hmm. uh, in CBC, as an institution, we are able to instill like four of them <laughs> to, to, to the, the, the learners yeah, through the production. Wow, wonderful. Mm -hmm. What a great way to look at it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I've never thought of it like that. <laughs> but you d there's a lot that the learners develop. Yeah. Um, now to you, Tyrus. Yes. Why did you decide to work with... Um, <laughs> high schoolers, why not, you know, campus students? Why did you settle for high schoolers? Uh, it's, a, it's a very, high schoolers is a very, very interesting demography. Mm -hmm. uh, let's, uh, I don't know, um, maybe you can look, look at it from the developmental, uh, developmental uh, face of a child. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the time they are realizing who they are. There's a lot of changes that is happening in their bodies, in mm -hmm. their minds. Mm -hmm. So there is, a, it's, a, I don't know, this is Kunai, Kunai Medali, Samaki Mkunze Angali Mbichi. Yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> you want to instill certain uh, tenets in a child. This is the best time. And they're still uh, teachable. Be, yes, they're mm. still teachable. They're still coachable. And you ca when you identify that they have something that uh, that you can develop, why not? Mm -hmm. For example, um, for this particular film, we are looking for children who have three talents. Which are? At a go. <laughs> so the child <laughs> has to be able to do the three. Three talents. I'm struggling to see which one <laughs> <At a go. laughs> <my> talent. <laughs> You're talking so about three, uh -huh. Yes. So um, they must be able to sing. They uh -huh. must be able to dance. And uh, they must be able to act. Wow. All at once. Sing, dance, and act. Yes. So they should be able to sing. At the, at the same time, you're performing. So you have, you're dancing and you're still in character. Wow. It's very hard to find that, uh, that, that, de that specific one because this movie is a, is a musical. In itself. Oh, it's, oh, it's a musical <laughs> yes. movie. Yes. Okay. <laughs> interesting. Interesting. You had three talents. Singing is okay, but <laughs> all right. You found them. You found them. Yes. How many are you working with in the in the movie? Uh, so uh, we we're working with a uh, team of around um, around twenty, mm -hmm. but there are also there are also others that of course just uh, support. So these are these are main cast. Mm -hmm. uh, there's a supporting cast, and there of course there are extras. Okay. So um, all this must be able to uh, exhibit aspects of all those three talents that I go. Including yes. the extras. Including the extras. Okay. Yeah. But the extras, <laughs> of course, I mean, the extras, I can't not so much. But I can't <laughs> wait to, to, to meet <laughs> them, just to hear them sing and <laughs> also just to watch the promo yeah. of them dancing and, and yeah. you know, acting yes. at the same time. And we're going to come back to you yes. to tell us about um, the movie. What's, what's the storyline all about? Ma, but before that, let me ask Jimmy, how is it uh, that the, you, you create a balance for them? Because I know you decide the timelines, because now you're the principal, of what time they're going to, to act. Because it takes a lot. I know it takes a lot mm -hmm. to do acting, like drama, you know, takes a lot of their time. And at the same time, they're also supposed to be focused on schoolwork. Mm -hmm. So how do you make sure that they create a balance? Um, that one has to be checked into uh, critically. Mm -hmm. Because as we have said, the current curriculum also uh, accommodates both academics and also the, the core curriculum. It's like it is now uh, merging the two. Mm -hmm. uh, first thing, we usually have to spend our time expeditiously. Like uh, whenever we have some short breaks, we have to. 
and uh, most of the time we also need to create more time. Mm. Time is not always available, it's created. created. Uh, we need uh, other than, uh, uh, there's at times we ev even had to work over the weekends, mm. uh, whenever we had the, the breaks in between. Uh, personally, I also deal with music, uh, other than being, being the principal of the school. Oh. Uh, I, I'm also a music teacher. I'm also yeah. a dramatist. It comes like in handy. Yeah, so that was <laughs> that is now <laughs> the best thing that you are able to now to, to, to be together with them. Mm -hmm. In the sense that uh, even before they came, I had also um, checked on some talents, identified some, some talents, those who can see, those who can act. So when they came, it was very easy for us to, to identify. Mm -hmm. So once you have identified a person with uh, the three talents, then it was very easy because it's not something that we do it uh, like we never did it for the movie on only. Mm. It's something that we, is the culture of the school okay. to incorporate. Okay. And uh, when the school is, is in session, we usually have those, I mean, uh, the, the different genres. Maybe in music, we also have this for acting. Mm -hmm. And uh, so when they come in, they are, they are those who had some background. I mean, already they had, uh, they were not very green. Mm -hmm. So when somebody is very green, that's what we, when we'll be having so, so much problem. And uh, they, they want some intensive training. But if you put it as a culture of the school, you inculcate uh, the whatever that they have in the skills. Then when it comes to that, we do not need much time. Mm -hmm. So the less time that we have to balance between the curriculum and the core curriculum, okay. now we are able to strike the balance very fast mm -hmm. because it's something that is not new to them. Okay. Yep. All right. And it's just hitting me now that uh, it's junior secondary school, yep. meaning that uh, there's only one class in junior, secondar junior secondary currently. Yes. 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 So <laughs> how, how is it? I mean, is it all the... He said 20, 20 students mm -hmm. and then uh, some Maybe others. More, yes. So what happens to the rest that are not part of it? Because it's, it seems like it's a, you know, si wingi sana. We, we try to make sure that everybody uh, took part. Mm. Generally, at, at the moment, uh, our population stands at 100 in uh, junior secondary school. Okay. But in the primary section, we are over 1,000. Uh, but majority of th those who are now in junior secondary school, they came from our primary school. Mm. And uh, therefore, it is also very easy for us because whatever they are, they are having at the moment in junior secondary school, we were able to inculcate to when they in, the, in, in, primary, in, okay. uh, in, in primary school. Therefore, it becomes very easy. And also, like uh, he says, there are some who are not so much that they, or they are learning. Uh, so we, we, we had to, in, to, to incorporate almost everybody. Like uh, there are some, some, some scenes where we, we, we require like uh, quite a number of the students, mm -hmm. maybe in the class, and uh, maybe to show the whole school, maybe on an assembly. Mm -hmm. So uh, we generally, I think we used everyone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> At least everyone participated. Fair uh, enough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, back yeah. to you, Tyrus. Yes. Um, you know, th is this the first that we're seeing of of this kind, or do we have another that we can compare to? I'm thinking of Tidy High, something <laughs> famous, but I know yeah. those are a bit older. The, yeah. You know, yeah. they were in high school, yes yeah. or not, but they were acting <laughs> as high schoolers. Yeah. So, is this uh, the first that we're seeing, or can we compare it to something else? Um, this is a find of its kind, the first of its kind mm. in this country. Um, and shooting a musical is not a, is not the, the concept there from conception is totally different. Mm -hmm. uh, by the time uh, this 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 idea is even just, uh, <laughs> it's 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 something you won't find anywhere. It's, it it would be very hard to compare. Yeah. Uh, uh, unless maybe we can get some copycats, then maybe <laughs> we can compare from that level. I don't know. <laughs> They'll be comparing to you. <laughs> they have you to <laughs> Yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, and why musical? Musical. Mm. Music speaks to the soul. Okay. It's a language everybody can understand. You mm. don't have to even lo know who, 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 what, what the person is saying. Mm -hmm. yes. okay. It's a very powerful medium of communication. All right. Yeah. And it's something <laughs> new that, yeah. uh, you know, in <laughs> Kenya at least, we're not yes. really used to the musical, mm. as you said. So give us yeah. the storyline. What's the movie all about? 
Uh, so this is where I have to give you the storyline without g giving too much. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah there's that. Because <laughs> yeah. there's an entire team. There's an entire team that is going to uh, st uh, kill me if I if I <laughs> give it all. <laughs> <If I give laughs> <all. laughs> we need to watch it at the end of the day. Yeah. Yeah. So, so give us a brief. Yeah. So let me give you a brief then. Uh, so it's uh, the story revolves around two kids, mm -hmm. um, totally different backgrounds, uh, different uh, schematics with that. Uh, they go through uh, struggles mm -hmm. that uh, make them, uh, th their personality comes out very different. Okay. So one is a bully, one is not. No. Both can sing, so, th so they connect with that. Mm -hmm. But they are rivals because one is a bully, one is not. Okay. Uh, there is an interl uh, there's an interlude between uh, what happens in school, what happens at home, uh, and, and how that now connects to the lives of these kids. Uh, mm -hmm. You can be able to see how that affects uh, maybe uh, they are, they are themselves and their friends and how that plays out. So it's a, it's, it's a film that is, it's a family film, mm. it's a kid's film, but uh, you will also learn something even as an adult uh -huh. quite, quite, quite well, yeah. Okay, yeah. so it's not just in the school setup because initially I thought it's just in the school setup. So no. we also have seeds at home, yes, yes. a yes, family yes. thing, yes. you know, the whole... Yes. Th there's, uh, a, there's a very, there's a very, um, there's a very interesting family setup back. Because, mm. uh, like, for example, I play, I play the part of, um, uh, I play a character called Ryan. So you're movie. part of the crew, okay? <laughs> 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 okay, you're part yeah. of the cast. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. right. And this this uh, Ryan is a guy who is uh, totally confused. Uh, breaks his family. Mm -hmm. um, his uh, his daughter is the bully. Okay. So the interplay or uh, the issues that happen at home, you can be able to see how that reflects on the mental health of a child and how she projects that now to her peers. Mm -hmm. So her, the character Bella has, has, has certain aspects uh, that she portrays, but the problems start way back at home. Okay. Yes. From so the you parent. get to see that in the movie. Yes. All right, quite <laughs> interesting. Looking forward to watching the movie. <laughs> yes. And uh, um, to you, uh, how is it, you know, coding? convincing parents mm -hmm. that their kids the ki their kids should do this in fact you know as much as it's time consuming you know mm -hmm. there's a lot of investment into it how mm -hmm. do you convince parents that this is not a waste of time that we should actually do it um now it all starts with the with the students themselves mm -hmm. uh first and foremost uh, before we go to that we, we are having junior secondary school Mm -hmm. It's called a junior school. And in junior school, we have seven, eight, and nine. That's where we are going. Mm -hmm. So we still have the senior one uh, later on. Yeah. So these are people who are between, uh, uh, who are previously in class seven, if, if exactly. you are to use the 844. Now, f to for coming to your question, we, we have to agree with the kids first. Mm -hmm. We have to agree because the, 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 the parent or the guardian are paid for the school fees and they have to get the value of their money. The value of their money is got from uh, their performance academically. So what we need to do, we agree with the kids. Now that you are also taking part in the movie, you must balance. Mm -hmm. You must strike a balance between the movie and the class. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, actually, I am so much categorical on the same. You not uh, fail to complete your assignment mm -hmm. in the name that you're in the film. Th actually, that will be the first thing that will make me remove Dr you out of the film. <laughs> yes. So you have to strike a balance between class mm -hmm. and uh, the, the, the film or any other co-curriculum activities. Okay. So by doing that, uh, it will make now the parent or the guardian to come in, mm -hmm. like uh, either by default or automatically because uh, if the child is, uh, it will be double gain. Yeah. The child is performing, the child is also good in, uh, I mean, uh, de we are de nurturing and developing the talents of the kid. And uh, they are moving in tandem and they're all, all in excellence. Mm -hmm. So the parent actually will now, uh, like the parents that we, th for the cast, let me speak of them, mm -hmm. they have been very cooperative. Because like when you hear, you have had, um, I mean, some shoots which were taken uh, uh, out of the school. So we have to create some time to go there. So you, you, you communicate with them. And actually some of them are kind enough even to drop the, the kids at school. Okay. 
Okay. And also, uh, they look forward, like, if you tell them we are also coming for interview, they are, they are very cooperative. Very open. They are very open. But we have to have to strike the balance between we, the teaching staff, and the kids. Okay. Then tell them we have, this is how we are going to do things. Mm -hmm. yep. Okay, great. I like it. Now, back to you. Um, how, how is the, what goes into um, doing such a production? especially uh, financially for, for someone who's looking into doing something similar. How much goes into it? Um, is this your way of asking me the budget of the thing? <laughs> <laughs> well, a good way, a kind <laughs> way of asking. <laughs> All yeah. right. Um, yes, there is, uh, there is quite some financial uh, overtures that we have, to, we have to look for, look at mm -hmm. uh, in a project like this. Uh, first of all, we are engaging a professional crew. A professional? Crew. Mm -hmm. So everybody has to get paid. Of course. Uh, so you can imagine, you can, you can just start from uh, like <laughs> how, how much. How much one director exactly. is paid. Yes, so from the directors, <laughs> uh, there is also equipment. Uh, we have equipment, mm -hmm. but there's always something you don't have. <laughs> so there's you have always, to hire. Yeah, there's always something you'll have to hire. That just goes for any, any, any production. Mm -hmm. uh, so there's also the financial um, uh, aspects of that. Uh, also, the other, the other, the other things that you wouldn't expect, for example, would be maybe traveling. Um, we, we're going out. The school has been really amazing mm -hmm. uh, with regards to, say, for example, transportation, um, coordinating that. It's been quite easy. So there are aspects that were quite easy for us to do. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, this is also my way of trying not to answer your question by giving <laughs> you the exact <laughs> figure. <laughs> figure it out for yeah, ourselves. Yeah, <laughs> so, you have to so we calculate how much is the director usually paid, yes, how yes. much is... <laughs> okay, yeah. so <laughs> you had that all planned out before you set out to begin yes. this? Yes, so we, we, did, we did have that all, all that planned out. Uh -huh. So now, um, you see, it's not always about money sometimes. Mm. Sometimes it's about who you're working with. Uh, you find a great partner in anything you do. Uh, anything of value can be bought. Okay. But if you have the valuable person, then you don't have to buy it. Well, so right. for us, we found valuable people, <laughs> a valuable school. <laughs> really valu so mm. it's, it's quite, um, there's a balance with that. So mm -hmm. it wasn't so much of a problem, but of course, it, uh, some pockets <laughs> are dented <laughs> out here. But at the end of the day, there's a bigger picture. Yes. <laughs> Will the movie be airing in cinemas, or when should we <laughs> and when should we expect the the movie? Yes. So uh, the movie will uh, will do a premiere. We have, we have a premiere coming up mm. on the 9th of December. Okay, 9th of December. Yes, 9th of December. Mm -hmm. uh, that is next month mm -hmm. at Fanari Hotel, okay. uh, Anga 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 Cinemas. Uh -huh. So we'll be airing we'll be airing it there for the very very first time uh, okay. for the general public. Mm -hmm. um, so anybody who wants to come and see this film uh, can be able to come around. Should come. Yeah. Nice. I don't know if I should add more details. Should I? Yes. How much? <laughs> like for instance, because we need to plan ourselves also right. <laughs> if we are coming. Right. Right. So how much will you be charging? What okay. time will it be adding? Yes. Yeah. Yes. All right. So uh, our gates will uh, will open at five thirty. Mm -hmm. So from five thirty, that's the time now. We, we'll have a red carpet uh, set up. All right. Uh, all Hollywood and stuff. Okay. So <laughs> <laughs> you probably need to wear your evening gown <laughs> and tell Good your producer. To make sure yes. you're going me on a kind of yeah, Very important. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, so uh, charges are just uh, 500 for students. Uh -huh. uh, it's a thousand uh, advance uh -huh. tickets. Um, at the gate, it it's going to be uh, 1,500. Mm -hmm. uh, VIP, VIP 3,000. Okay. And uh, group of five. 4,000. So you get, if you come for, if you get a ticket uh, that is a group of five, uh, yeah. a thousand off. A thousand off. Yeah. Uh, good way to save. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we are always going for a break, but I, I realize I've not asked some of the challenges that yes. you guys have faced yes. because finances are not a challenge <laughs> for you. <laughs> 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 what are some of the challenges to, to you both before we take a break and then come yes. back now with the cast themselves to give us their own experience? Okay. Let me start with you. Uh, now, uh, of course, when you are set out to do something, mm -hmm. we usually have uh, ch uh, challenges that uh, we face here and there. Mm -hmm. um, actually, the first one, not a challenge as per se, because we were not, uh, mm -hmm. we were able to identify the casts. Uh, mm -hmm. 
but now also get in a cast that uh, will exhibit the, the, the three talents. Somebody would sing, somebody who would uh, uh, act and dance. So it was quite challenging uh, because you will find a person who would act very well but uh, with no can vocals at all. Not everybody can <laughs> sing. Yeah? You know, if you say everyone can sing, yeah, we, we sing maybe in the bathroom, but <laughs> everybody can sing in the bathroom. Yeah? Okay. But now the, the proper singing, because actually like uh, he says, eh, we, as a school also, we, we were not ready to do some uh, mediocre kind of thing. Eh? So yeah. we needed something that is perfect, excellent. something that is excellent, something that is also reflected what we do mm. <laughs> in school. Okay. Uh, therefore, also getting, uh, it was quite challenging, like uh, getting the cast mm -hmm. uh, who were having the three uh, talents. So we needed to work on them right. because you find that somebody who is vocally would sing so well. But now acting. maybe their acting is also a problem. So we, we, we had to, to do that. Uh, timing also, like uh, in our case, we, we in, the, in, the, in the junior school, uh, and not until when the, the, the government had to slot some learning areas. Mm -hmm. We were having a lot of learning areas <laughs> that require a, a lot of time mm -hmm. uh, in class. So we also had to use our time expeditiously uh, because mm -hmm. uh, the crew, Maya uh, is not uh, located in our school, so we have to, to mm -hmm. make sure that they are there and uh, also have some clash programs <laughs> here and there. And, uh, and also making everybody buy the idea. You know, I have the idea, uh, despite being the principal of the school, so I'm, also I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a dramatist, <laughs> I have all those things. Eh? Yeah. I have also ma ma to make sure that also my teachers and everybody involved mm -hmm. uh, gets to know to own the project because oh, yeah. we have the teaching and the non-teaching. The non-teaching will come in handy when we need to feed the children, and so you have to make everybody own up. Okay. That is the project of the school. It's not my project. It's not a project for our directors. Yeah. It is for the project for everyone. So making everybody, so you, you 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 have to know how to make everybody own the project so that it runs seamlessly. Mm -hmm. So th I would say those were the challenges, but not quite uh, big way. Not big quite big, big challenges. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All we right. are able to manage them. Uh -huh. And as they said, th they have also said that uh, we they, we w we were able to accord them the cooperation they required. I, I must. I, it will also mm -hmm. go out, uh, not properly. If we also do not recognize what they did. Mm -hmm. They are they are marvelous guys. You know, with a crew of between 20 and 30 at uh, times, and they are also coming to the school. I uh, actually have to recommend them. They did a very good job. Yeah. Uh, they also undertook themselves with the decorum. We enjoy working with them. They are good. It's a, it's Clearly, a, it's a good I mean, <laughs> 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 the phrases are going yeah. back and forth. Yeah. It's, it's a good thing. Mm -hmm. I don't want to ask you a similar question, uh, mm. unless you have something different of a challenge. Yeah, what, yeah. what is your win, challenge and win, challenge as, and we, win. as we take okay. a break? Um, challenge. I, I think the biggest challenge that we we faced, uh, we're still facing it, uh, even right now, is what next. Mm -hmm. It is a very, it's a question everybody is asking. So, okay, so we've done the movie, then what? What next? So to answer that, we have a, uh, this is, this is uh, maybe a tit bit. We, we, we have a sequel coming. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so there's something coming. So definitely. All right. Yeah. That's, that's good to know. Biggest win, mm -hmm. um, we can say we, we did it and we have God on our side. Wow. So, awesome. Move, the movie is out there now. <laughs> 9th December. 9th December, Panari Hotel. Yeah. All right, yes. thank you. So uh, <laughs> where can people get, get you, you guys, uh, yes. Maya Production? Maya Production on TikTok, Facebook, mm -hmm. on YouTube. Maya Production. Yes. And then there's Greenview. We have uh, Greenview Schools. It's say Greenview Schools Kamulu. Okay. Because maybe in the, in the Republic we also have Greenview Schools. <laughs> <laughs> we have ours is Greenview Schools Kamulu. You find us in our Facebook on our Facebook page. Mm -hmm. Then we also have a YouTube channel on the same. Okay. Yep. 
Sawa, sawa. Thank you, guys. Uh, Thank you so we're much. now going to have the next team come on board <laughs> right after this break. We, uh, the movie itself is called Born to Shine, done by the Maya Production in collaboration with the Green View School, Kamulu. So uh, stick with us. We'll be right back with the trailer. All right? Good. <laughs> 